What's up guys? In this tutorial, I will show you how to fix the login error you are getting when trying to play Wuthering Waves on your PC. First, make sure to completely close the Wuthering Waves game launcher. This ensures that any changes you make to your network settings will be applied properly when you relaunch the game. If you are currently playing on a hotspot connection, switch to a regular Wi-Fi or Ethernet connection. Hotspot connections can be unstable and cause network-related errors, including login issues. To do this, open your Windows settings, go to the Network and Internet section and select your Wi-Fi network or connect an Ethernet cable for a more stable connection. A VPN can sometimes cause network issues in games. While you are in your network settings, click on VPN and disable any active VPN connections temporarily to see if this fixes the error. On the other hand, using a VPN can sometimes help bypass network restrictions. To ensure that your firewall isn't blocking the game's connection, search for Firewall in your Start menu to access the Firewall and Network Protection settings window. Click on Allow an app through Firewall. In this window, click on Change settings and then select Wuthering Waves from the list of applications. If the app is not showing up, click on Allow another app and then click on Browse. Navigate to the drive where you installed Wuthering Waves, typically under Program Files, Epic Games, Wuthering Waves, G5003. Select Wuthering Waves and add it to your list of applications. Ensure the app is checked for both private and public networks before clicking on OK. Running the game as an administrator can help resolve permission-related issues that might be causing the network error. To do this, Find the Wuthering Waves game files by opening your file explorer and heading to Program Files, Epic Games, Wuthering Waves. Here, right-click the game application and select Properties. In the new window, go to the Compatibility section and check the Run this program as an administrator box, click Apply and then OK. Keeping your Windows OS and drivers up to date can prevent compatibility issues with your network hardware. Open your Windows settings and navigate to the Windows Update section. Click on Check for Updates and download and install any available updates. Restart your PC to ensure the updates are properly installed and to apply any previously made changes to your network and firewall settings. Additionally, ensure your network drivers are up to date. Open Device Manager by searching for it in the Start menu. Expand the Network Adapter section. Right-click your network adapter and select Update Driver. Follow the prompts to update the driver. Another useful tip is to clear your DNS cache, which can sometimes resolve network-related issues. To do this, open Commands Prompt as an administrator by searching for CMD in the Start menu, right-clicking it and selecting Run as Administrator. In the Commands Prompt window, type ipconfig slash flush DNS and press Enter. I hope this helped you out, leave a comment if you have any questions and see you in the next one.